Okay, Nav, I'm excited to tell you about this. You already know this news as well. Crypto.com. Crypto.com arena. Wait, wait, Mo, what, what do we always <laughs> say to people? This is inevitable. Times are changing. Things are coming, man. Inevitable. Look at this. Do, do you know this iconic this is, this stadium? Is, this is crazy, bro. I don't even want to talk arena. about how much money was thrown at, thrown at the owners of this arena for this deal. So <laughs> according to this article, it says Crypto.com is spending $700 million in cash. <laughs> I don't even know why. Uh, that. You see me to like, rename right Staples Center in Los Angeles. Okay, hot take. What do you think about this? First of all, this, like you said, this is the future. Seven hundred million in cash, bro. In Not cash. even Bitcoin or Ethereum. They just say no. Just put just straight cash. So this is exciting because, like, I know we're gonna talk about some more stuff, but this is this is what's coming next, right? And what's cool is, eventually, they're gonna start accepting crypto at the arenas, at the games, and things are going to become more mainstream. Oh, well, talking about that, so oh. I, I, I uh, you've spoken too soon. Listen to this. Listen to this. There are 10 million Crypto.com users. The top brass, they... Oh, wait, 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 <laughs> wait, 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 wrong clip. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. Now, this is really interesting. Listen to this. AEG, the current owner and the operator of the arena, says that they and Crypto.com are working out details about how to integrate cryptocurrency payments in the arena and maybe even in online purchases in the future. Okay, but right here, right here. <laughs> so you, you, you just, you <laughs> literally brain. just called it. You literally just called it. Like, that's exactly what they're going to be doing. And... I think what they're doing is actually a big smart move on branding. And uh, think about it: like, how many people actually go to the Staples Center? Well, it's an iconic arena in LA, one of the you know, be, you know one of the biggest cities you know in in the states. It's like a hot spot, and all the think about all the concerts, not just basketball games. Exactly, all the other sporting events, all the concerts and things that happen there. Like, and now it's the Crypto.com <laughs> Arena. So by virtue, they have 10 million users right now. Which I also, if you agree with me, Mo, that's super small. This number yeah. is gonna get yeah. huge. It's, bro. it's only ten million, right? It's yeah, gonna yeah. get huge. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> you know, adoption is gonna be there. I, I can't imagine what they're gonna do to incentivize people, you know, to download the app and get involved with Crypto.com. Yeah, and then um, just like a last thing, and I thought that was interesting. Like in this uh, in this uh, news piece here, this is uh, what they say. They say what they're really trying to do is increase brand awareness. They want to follow in the footsteps of Nike and Apple. So, no, Crypto.com doesn't roll off the tongue, but... Do you really care if it rolls off the tongue? Yeah. So, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of people on social media complain, like, oh, it should have been called the Crypto Center and all that kind of stuff. But then they like, crypto is such a broad word. It had to be Crypto.com. I agree. Like, and you have to, like, because this is the only way to brand yourself. You have to yeah. write in Crypto.com online to be able to buy and and honestly uh, it's one of the best websites i've ever heard of because if you're trying to buy crypto <laughs> crypto.com honestly it's better than coinbase it's better than a lot of these other games. I, I think it was a big big move on them and it's a smart move i am excited for it I, I know even some players like in the nba weren't like super happy about it but <laughs> change always change is always good it's good people are always like afraid of change they don't like change but it's the future it's uh you know just how it is <laughs> e embrace it hop on as always drop a like man follow us up comment down below I, actually you know what mo what is the next arena what's the next big play Ooh. we're gonna see in the crypto world where someone comes in and names something because i you know what i'm thinking next bro which one i'm just thinking a soccer stadium somewhere in europe i'm thinking somewhere where Messi and these guys are playing. oh oh the button of bear what if what if, what if they, or... they sponsor one of the future like world cups or UA, oh. UA, you know you if a tournament champion yo that would be huge that would be huge. Different game right there. Let us know if you guys think another arena should be named or what should it be named. All right, catch you guys later.